hi youtube fam it's me again welcome back to my channel i hope you have been well since last time today i'm going to show you how to make a rug using old denim clothes if you are new to my youtube channel please subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell below so that you'll be notified every time i post a new video also, don't forget to like, to share, and to comment if you have any questions. The materials needed are scissors, needle, thread, and of course the old denim clothes or jeans. So let's get to business and see what happens. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to trim the denim into thin strips using scissors. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to attach or sew together the short strips so that I end up with only three long strips or ropes. I have started sewing together the strips or attaching them to each other. And this is how it looks. I continue binding them together and I'm looking for the navy blue strips because I want to bind them first and then I will attach the light blue ones later. I'm sorry that my table is a bit full but I hope you don't get confused. At the end of the day, it's simple. We are just binding together the pieces, the short pieces, in order to end up with only three longer strips. Only three longer strips. Now we have the three long strips. They are so, so long. I'm just stretching them so that you can be able to see how long they are. The next thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to sew together the tips of each of the ends of the three long strips and after that I'll start making a rope, a three strand rope or I'll start braiding them together. This is the long rope and it's just one but a long rope. The next thing, I'll start rolling or rotating the rope on a flat surface in a circular motion.
I'll continue rotating it up to the end of the rope and while I'm rotating it I'll make sure that it is as flat as possible because at the end of the day I want to end up with a flat surface rug. Last but not least, I will start sewing or binding together the coils using a needle. We are almost done. You can see that it's not a long process because we are in the final stage. We are already done and I'm going to give you a closer look of what I just made. You can see that it looks so perfect even when it's turned upside down and it's so smooth to touch. So this is the final look. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Bye. Breaking out in the best of ways, and I'm back again on the street.